Good morning, YouTube. Today, we're going to film the video that none of you asked for. We're going to go work on my boat. If you're new to the channel, my name is Dan, and this is my garage, and this channel is normally all about the supercar ownership experience. But some of you that have been watching for a while know that I bought a 24-foot Fountain CS boat, and it's pretty badass, and it needs some work. And that was the whole point, is to buy it, kind of fix it up, enjoy it for a little bit, and then sell it. So it's at my buddy Ben's house. He was a partner on the boat with me. He went in and bought it with me. And we're gonna go out to his house, and we gotta pull out the entire interior, basically, because it's trash. So we're gonna gut the interior, send it off to get fixed up, get some new leather put on, and, well, I guess vinyl, and then off it goes. And it's back in the water, and we get to have some fun. I know none of you really care about this, but, Whatever, you can choose not to watch it. So real quick, if you want to support us, please like, share, and subscribe, hit the notification bell, and go visit normalguyssupercar.com. Believe it or not, we actually sell some stuff for boats on that website. We actually have ceramic coating for boats and polishing kits and other things for boats. Glide Coat sells some awesome stuff for your boats, but also sells some stuff for your car. So we've actually used Glide Coat on some cars, and it's amazing. So. Go check that out. It's really good ceramic coating. I'm very, very pleased with it. So far, it's we've had it on a few cars and it's lasted over, I don't know, eight, 10 months now and the water beads up perfectly. So the boat also has it on it and you'll see the boat looks amazing. We did an amazing job on the restorations. Let's go out and play with the boat. All right, YouTube, there's the 24 foot Fountain CS. So what we're gonna do is again, we're gonna get it uncovered and start popping off all of the interior. So it's been kind of sitting here a while. I love this boat, it's pretty badass. All right, let's uh, let's hop in there and take a look. All right, YouTube, so you can see, yeah, we need to get this sun deck taken off. It is in terrible shape. So we're gonna remove the sun deck, get it off entirely, and then go into the interior of the boat. So the backs of the seats are actually okay. We already had this seat bottom done, but like this trim, I mean, that's all just terrible. You can see it's just completely destroyed so funny enough uh, it looks like some rats were in here because they shredded up one of the uh, towels that was in the boat not surprised I mean uh, you know it happens everything else seems to be okay hopefully uh, a little bit of debris from the rats we'll get these panels off and send them out to get refinished all right so we got the Sun deck raised up and basically all those little plugs have a bolt and we're gonna undo all those bolts and then I believe the Sun deck should pop off of off of that lid so we can get that out of the way. And then there's a bunch of bolts to get these off. And I haven't figured out how to get the seat bottoms out. Cause I think we're gonna leave the seat backs. They're in really good shape. The seat bottoms look terrible. Got the sun deck off. Now we just uh, start getting off all these pieces. Uh, so far it's been pretty easy. Just a bunch of screws to undo or nuts to undo and bolts and stuff. And that's kind of it. Some of the wood trim underneath the leather or the vinyl is totally destroyed so it probably needs to be replaced so it's a good thing we're doing this all right youtube almost there one more piece got all of this off yeah i shouldn't have said it was easy because now it's becoming a total pain in the ass it's just annoying there's just a lot of hard to reach screws or bolts you know they're way up in weird positions hopefully we can get this one off without too much more trouble all right youtube everything's removed seats are gone now it's just time to send it off to jay at just like new interiors and get it replaced put it back together and then hit the water Two thousand years later. Hey YouTube, remember the boat? Yeah, we finally got the interior back. It's been about two months, and so we're gonna reinstall the interior, and then we're gonna take the boat out later this week. That's the plan, anyway. Things are going lately. Yeah, I have no idea. Let's attempt to get the boat put back together. Oh my gosh! Look at, look at this. We have <laughs> an interior that has no cracks. It's all nice. Oh my God, it looks so, so very good. Oh uh, yeah, all right. Well, I think I'm gonna start with all the side trims. That way we don't have the seats in the way and then we'll do the seats last. I think that's a better solution. We're almost there. Josh showed up to help, thank God. <laughs> this boat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, anyway, it's looking nice. Uh, still a pain in the ass, serious pain in the ass. All right, YouTube, it's installed. Uh, we need to clean it up. There's like, you know, crap all over. But you like that? I had a, I had a fountain logo put on, <laughs> cause why not? Yeah, and the seats look nice. So I think it's time to go boating tomorrow. Well, not tomorrow, the next day. Uh. All right, guys. Jay's here. We're getting the top off. He's gonna take it and extend this one down a little, and get that one fixed. So we're just gonna take off the whole deck lid, cause we think that's gonna be easier. 
Yeah, it's probably a lot easier. <laughs> Cause then you can work on it on the ground. We just popped off the pins and everything and now we just gotta actually get it off because it's actually kind of heavy. We have to push, like yeah, push gonna, down. So we're getting the last section off so that we can oh, actually, oh, yeah, get that redone. Well, she's naked, so off goes the panels to get fixed. And then once those are done, this thing is basically all set and we're ready to kick some ass. Oh, and it was doing a vapor lock, so we need to fix the fuel filter is on this side and it sits right next to the headers and I think that's causing it to get vapor lock because it's basically overheating the fuel filter. So we need to put some sort of cover or something, maybe like a heat shielding or maybe even, I don't know, relocate the fuel filter with a reloca relocation kit, something like that. Three weeks later. Well, good morning YouTube. We're back at the boat. It's been a few more weeks and it's done and it's for sale and someone's coming to look at it today. Hopefully they buy it. And the reason I'm selling it is because, well, I'm a complete moron and I bought another boat. <laughs> I, I know, I have a problem. It's, I'm, yeah. Anyway, let's take a look at the interior now that it's actually done. Ta-da, look at this. Ah, oh, it's like a whole new boat. It looks amazing, I have to say. This is really quite good looking. Wow, so someone's gonna get a really good boat. I'm selling it for $25,000, that's it. Runs perfect, drives really well, looks incredible. Yeah, this is a good deal. So hopefully it's gone quickly. Well, I should probably give it a quick wash just so it looks really nice for the potential buyer. Yeah, I guess maybe I'll probably set it up to be able to run it out of water. So there's like, uh, they call them like muffs or engine muffs or something. Anyway, put it over where it sucks in water and then it can keep itself cool. It's pretty interesting actually. Alright YouTube, she's all cleaned up, ready to be sold. If one of you wants this boat, email me dan at normalguyssupercar.com. This is not through our dealership, this is a private sale, it's through me. Yeah, I'm gonna miss this thing, but it's an awesome boat. But at the same time, the other boats would be really cool too, so I'll show you that as soon as we get it, and uh, we'll go out in the lake, do some fun stuff. That's gonna do it for this video, you guys are amazing, thank you so much for watching. Sorry it took so long, but you know, nothing in life is fast right now. Like, share, and subscribe maybe, and check out our other videos.